Hi Leo, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of March 5th, 2018. Thank you guys for stopping by. If you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Also, if you have a connection with a Virgo, Virgo is getting the bonus video this month for their amount of views in February, and that will post in the next few hours on the channel's playlist under monthly videos. If you guys are seeking a psychic reading, please contact me on the link below this video, or you can always reach me at JackieTomlin.com, and don't forget to check out Jackie Psychics. You guys are under some real mild energy this week. Um, small wishes are being granted and new doors are opening, but it comes from taking time to yourself. Uh, this is really a week to look inside, to work on yourself, kind of slow down a little bit, think before you speak. Just really taking some time out for yourself this week. So let's take a look. This is for Leo for the week of March 5th, 2018. Starting with the Nine of Wands, the Ace of Cups, the Queen of Wands, the King of Cups, the Eight of Cups, and the Empress. Now, I'm going to break this down for you guys, and I'm going to pull you three more. Starting with the Nine of Wands, you, may, you guys may be feeling a little bit overwhelmed this week. That This might be that need to take that time out to yourself. Just that overwhelming feeling of maybe there's too much to get done, there's too much on the list this week. Ace of Cups, new beginnings in the love life. Now, for those that are coupled situations, this is really good communications with you guys. And for my single Leos out there, this is a great time to bring something new in. Next to that, we have the Queen of Wands. And the Queen of Wands shows that you're going to do just that. It's taking some time to work on some self-esteem issues and just taking some time for yourself. Moving forward, we have the King of Cups. We have the Eight of Cups, and we have the Empress. King of Cups shows you guys, um, even though you're taking time off to yourself, your balance has been restored. You're pretty much grounded, okay? So you're in a good energy spot. Next to that is where I'm talking about taking that time for yourself. Eight of Cups, take a look at that card. It's looking over the past, reflection. What worked well for you? What didn't work well for you? Uh, holding on to your goals and making new goals. Next to that, we have the Empress card, which is the Happy Home. Also the Mother card. So small percentage of you guys, it could indicate news of a pregnancy as well. Moving forward, we have the High Priestess. We have a Major Archon of Justice. And we have the Four Pentacles. High Priestess, going back to what I said, you guys are grounded you're in a good spot. Um, it's not a real active week for you guys, but it shows that you are taking the correct action on what needs to be done. Beside that, we have justice. And with coupled with that high priestess, this indicates justice is in your favor. Now, for some of you, this could also indicate the signing of a contract or, the, or a very large purchase. But either way, it does show it's in your favor. Beside that, we have the four pentacles. Four of pentacles indicates in the financial sector, stability, but not only just stability, is spending money wisely. No frivolous decisions at this time. So a good way just to apply money where it needs to be applied. So what you're looking at for your major arcanas this week, don't forget there's new beginnings in the love life. We have total and complete happiness on the home front. We have the high priestess to indicate that you're grounded and you're in a good spot. And we also have justice to show justice is in your favor this week. So thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I will see you soon and have a great week. Bye.